estimate the area under the curve of cosine. So let me just draw a rough cosine curve from 0 to pi over 2. So from 0 to pi over 2, it looks like this. It starts from 1 and ends at pi over 2. Now what we want to do is approx approximate this area using right endpoints, and we want to use four of them. So let me cut it in half, cut it in half again. Okay, and what we do is we take the height on the right side, like that. Okay, take the height on the right side, right side, and this is going to be just flat. Okay, so essentially it's the sum of these three rectangles. One, two, three. Okay, so before I even answer the question, I can already answer this. Is your estimate an underestimate or an overestimate? Clearly, it's the area smaller than the actual area of the entire curvature, right? Okay, so it's an underestimate. So let's actually find it. Uh, the sum, okay, I'm just gonna say sum is, okay, all of these, right, this base, that's exactly a quarter of this total length, which is pi over two. So a quarter of the total length. So it's gonna be pi over eight. Okay, that's the base. Okay. And I'm just gonna add up the heights in here. Okay, the height, the first height is cosine of this is pi over eight. Next one is gonna be cosine of okay, two pi over eight, which is pi over four. Next is going to be cosine of 3 pi over 8. Okay. So this is the factor form. These are all heights. This is the base. If I expand, you get height times base, height times base, and height times base. So this will give you the area of some of the three rectangles. Okay, so let me just punch that in the calculator and okay, we get approximately 0 0.79. Okay, 0 0.79. Now part B says, uh, do the same question except do it from the left end point. Okay, so from the left end point, we're going to take initially the zero, x equals zero is the height. Okay, so which is right there. And this is the first rectangle. Okay, all the way up. It's, it goes above the graph. Second, it's going to be like this. Third, you take the height here. So it's going to be like, like that. And lastly, it's going to be here. So you can see it, this is going to be an overestimate now, okay, from the left hand points. Again, okay, so the left hand point, the first uh, first base is, um, sorry, the first height is taken at cosine of zero, again, times by pi over eight. That's the base. And then it's going to be cosine of pi, um, pi over eight. And then it's going to be cosine of um, pi over 4, 2 pi over 8. So pi over 4. And then lastly, it's going to be pi over 8 cosine of uh, 3 pi over 8. Okay, so we got to add these four up. And we get 1.18 approximately. You can see it's a lot bigger.